Here you go, she's here With her Welshness for your ears To read you what you think is nice Whether calm or funny or maybe spice Her dog by her side Colin cooches down And Poppy, her old cat, curls up all round In the evening, in the daytime Welsh lady reads to you anytime She'll crack you up, she'll make you cry You'll be wearing pants that are left undry She's your very own Welsh lady And she's here to make you laugh, make you smile, make you weep Even send you off to sleep Her family are sheep Oh, she's Welsh Lady Reeves Yes, she's Welsh Lady Reeves You know you mean so much to her She tells you in her comments here She may sometimes struggle, she may fight but Jack is who gives her her might Just don't cause the dragon flames As then she's not playing games In the evening, in the evening, in the daytime Welsh lady reads to you anytime She'll crack you up, she'll make you cry You'll be wearing pants that are left undry She's your very own Welsh lady And she's here to make you laugh, make you smile, make you weep Even send you off to sleep Her family are sheep Oh, she's Welsh Lady Reeds Yes, she's Welsh Lady Reeds You know you mean so much to her She tells you in her comments here she may sometimes struggle, she may fight But chat is who gives her her might Just don't cause the dragon flames As then she's not playing games In the evening, in the evening, in the daytime Welsh lady reads to you anytime She'll crack you up, she'll make you cry You'll be wearing pants that are left undry She's your very own Welsh lady And she's here to make you laugh Make you smile, make you weep Even send you off to sleep Her family are sheep Oh, she's Welsh Lady Reeds Yes, she's Welsh Lady Reeds Oh, she's your Welsh Lady Reed. Hello, chat. How are you, Welsh Lady? Good to see you or be with you. I'm wondering whether how many of you are singing along to my theme song. <laughs> Oh, she's Welsh Lady Reeves. <laughs> My family is sheep. <laughs> I hope you enjoy it anyway, even if you're not into jazz music. <laughs> uh, oh, I thought it would be best to get back onto it. Well, um, should I put that a different way? Uh, I best, yeah, no, I best get to back to it. Um, <laughs> I thought I'd finish off the, the, the boon letters that I've got um, before I take on the uh, enormous one. And because there's, gonna, there's another one after that. And gosh, she's just never ending, man. She's, but you know, she's, uh, we, we keep up to date with her because of the trials and everything. So I thought I'd do some of that and um, and I'm going to go throughout the day now to see, do a few different ones, each uh, video and um, see if I can get them uploaded for you. 
uh, please like and uh, subscribe and check your notifications um, at our click to all. Check your subscribe buttons, chat, because uh, a lot, a lot of places, uh, we're all going through it. Uh, huge Hoob is um, deciding to um, take off some subscribers. Um, and you might have heard through the Rumerville. Rumerville? Well, that's one way. Rumerville. It's like a house with rumours in it. Just called Rumerville. <laughs> Rumor mill. <laughs> I quite like rumor rumor mill. I can say it again. I prefer that. I think. Yeah. Let's go to rumorville where we just sit there and listen to rumors. Um. Anyway, sorry. Uh. Yeah. You might have heard that YouTubers taking some sub subscribers away because they think they're bots or they're inactive. Or I'm inactive, or chat's inactive, I don't know. I'm just saying, just check you so still subscribed, all right, my lovelies. I, I, you know, understand people read at their own pace and they pick, they pick which ones they like to read more or so, whether it's the books or whether it's the letters or whether it's any special requests so just check click all check all is is on your channel settings in back in in the back end of youtube in your notification settings go and have a check of there because find that they sometimes muted on the back end um okay so i'm gonna start with uh Oh, good old Welsh Sarah Bone, eh? But I've got, um, we've done letters 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9 in three different videos. So anybody catching up now might want to go back and, and have a look at those videos. Um, so they're, uh, and, and just so you know, chat, right, I've got a kind of method in my madness, right, in the the way that I order things in my YouTube. Now, I it displays it to you, I'm not quite sure. But for me, if, if you go back to when I very first started, so my very first one, and then they go from there. So it's all old as to new. And then what you'll see is like the book will have a tent icon and it'll be part one, part two, part three. And then you'll see special requests and, and that was where you'll find um, Wonky Donkey and um, my dad's little pecker and all the funnier kind of adult ones, you know. Not that this is not adult, everything is adult too, but uh, you know what I mean. Um... And also then you, you'll you see that there might be some trial-related stuff, like the walk the dog letter or the boon letters. Um, so, yes, uh, just have a little look. There's, there is a method in my madness to uh, the folklore. Say, for example, I'll tend to put a fairy next to them so you can you can keep track on the folklore ones. So, it is a method there, but it's a kind, I suppose, if I don't share the method, I mean, you know, it might not, it's just, just my method, isn't it? It's just, and then just gets all a bit method up. <laughs> method up. <laughs> anyway, okay, so let's go to uh, Sarah Boone's letter um, number 10. Right, we're in double digits. Oh. So this was sent on August the second, twenty twenty three, to Judge Wooten. So we're still we're still with Judge Wooten, right? I know that you might have heard of of letters ahead at this time, but I'm doing a kind of recap, I suppose, all for them, and um, and because just for the heck of it, Sarah Boone's she's Welsh. I just decided to make her Welsh, and. Because, you know, the accent and that. Anyway, she writes a letter and it says, Honourable Judge Wooten, please see included letter I received from my investigator. 
communicating, underlined. Oh, if you haven't been here before, she shouts. If I shout, it's because it's in capital letters. If it's quotations, I'll tell you. If it's underlined, if it's bolded, I'll tell you. But she loves her numbers. We know this. So I'll tell you, right? But hopefully you've got kind of the hang of uh, Sarah Boone's uh, gist of writing. Uh, so, yes. So from my investigator, communicating underlined with me to provide an up it underlined on why we have been unable to meet since our last uneventful meeting with my attorney, Frank Bankovitz, on May 18th, 2023. <laughs> she, she's got her investigator on to it. <laughs> my investigator also has not been able to make contact in attempts to move forward and produce very much needed and overdue progress in my case. I, as Mr Bankovitz's client, cannot communicate with him via phone due to him still not activating one of two numbers he's given me that do not work. And he keeps giving me different reasons why each time I ask to keep trying. This has been ongoing for 13 months. And counting. <laughs> by not activating, he is actively hindering progress, compiling even greater amounts of carryover. And in the meantime, in quotations, Information for review with when or if we do eventually meet in person. Last time to date was 77 days. Prior to that was 98 days and 147 days prior to that date. With the aforementioned being said, Judge Wooten, would you please be gracious enough to communicate with Mr Bankovitz to supply the requested simple information my investigator needs. <laughs> Considering the number of days slash weeks in between our meetings with him and we can be working, quotation, in the meantime. Oh, she said sark. <laughs> I, she's sarky. And I think you call it snark over there. It's snark, sarky, same thing. Until he is able to visit with me, his client, <laughs> of over a year now, adding to the soon-to-be four years I have been already here. Brackets, please see previous letter regarding all of my attorneys, all six of them. <laughs> Close brackets. <laughs> my innumerable attempts have been completely unsuccessful in any form of communication with Mr Bankovitz via phone, letters, emails and voicemails. Brackets. Attempted by an outside source. Close brackets. What else can I do, Your Honour? It seems my only hope is for a court date. Brackets. Which I am included in. Close brackets. Where my attorney's attendance is mandatory and I can vie for his attention. <laughs> During the minute or minutes beforehand while in the courtroom. I'm sure all the allowed live cameras could provide footage of me doing so every time. I don't want to waste any more time and, quotation, catch up in the courtroom. <laughs> it's unfair and ridiculous. When we can have a real meeting? Question mark. Please enable progress, Judge Wooten, not hinder. Justice, quotation, system, close quotations, means we have to work together. I've got the whole world incorrectly against me. <laughs> As stated by my investigator, we are at a loss. <laughs> So that's anything else then. We are at a loss without communication in any form with Mr. Bankovitz. 
Thank you for your invaluable time. I'm great grateful for your ethical awareness, fairness, understanding and perspective. Activate the inactivity, please. Again, thank you. Actively seeking success in anything. <laughs> Well, Sarah Boone. <laughs> oh, there's an attachment. There's an attachment. What's this now? Let's have a look. Oh, it's a letter to Sarah from her investigator. <laughs> it's not seriously called that, is it? Prison Break Investigations. <laughs> It's a blooming good series I was on telly. I enjoyed that. <laughs> okay. Prison break. It must, but, but that catches your attention, I suppose, as a private investigator. Okay. <laughs> Prison break. <laughs> Sorry, John. <laughs> Bear with. <laughs> oh, this is to say that. I have received your letter. I have made multiple attempts to contact your attorney, Mr. Bankovic, since our meeting, but unfortunately I have been unsuccessful. I am not sure what is causing the issue. On May 22nd, 2023, I sent him an email requesting him to contact the jail so that I can have access to visit you and proceed with the mitigation process in person. Additionally, I sent two text messages to his phone on June 1st, 2023 and again on June 6th, 2023, but received no response. Without a letter from the attorney sent to the jail, I am unable to visit you in person at the jail. I am at a loss until I can re-establish contact with Mr. Bankovitz. If you wish, you can write to me and I will send a letter as soon as I am able to get in touch with him again. Oh dear. And that was from Billy, Billy Lane. Billy Lane from Prison Break Investigations. Yep, she sent her letter, letter number 10. <laughs> so, it cracks me up. Mr. Bangers has not been very helpful, really, has he? Let's be fair, we know. We give fairness to you where it is due. Though patience has you know, been wearing thin with me with Sarah for a little while, I am still trying to be fair in the fact that I don't think that that is um, a good representation from an attorney. But at the same time, we're not here in the other side. So I am very well aware there's another side to this story. Absolutely aware because she's just so oblivious. Uh, given, you know, regards the success of a case. Moving forward. On March, let's go. Um. Anyway, sorry. I'm. Uh, I'm doing. Uh, I think it's called a squirrel. I think I'm doing a squirrel. Yeah, I'm having a squirrel moment. Okay. So the next letter chat, letter number eleven, was sent on August twenty sixth of twenty twenty three. Brackets. A hundred more days of no communication. Close brackets. <laughs> She keeps going. The judge not because she just sends them, signs them, sends them back. You know, stamps them rather and sends them back. Because uh, you can't communicate with a judge when you have an attorney. You can't and you you can't do this. This is contacting the judge like this is inappropriate. Ah, <sighs> so anyway, Judge Wooten. Quotation: How do you feel about your attorney withdrawing? During an attempted video, close quotation, during an attempted video visit by a misrepresented, shifty, quotation, reporter, this is how I was made aware of my, quote, attorney, close quote, Frank Bankovitz, cowardly, and for the second time, trying to ungracefully bow out of my case. 
Mr. Matt Johnson, please, you, please honour the integrity and ethics of a real reporter and not a camouflage. Right, hang on a minute. Not That's my mistake, not a camouflage. What are you talking about, Welsh? Now, come on now. Mr. Johnston, Johnson, please honour the integrity and ethics of a real reporter and not camouflage yourself as my friend in order to push your way through the rules and regulations of the correctional facility. Quotation, professional, quotes, quotes, is also an option when scheduling, but clearly does not pertain to you. Just don't schedule at all as I have nothing to report to you or court to EV altogether. Oh dear. Oh no, no, no. You're not even a real news channel and only add to the confusion and hysterics wrongfully, illegally and inappropriately concocted in my case. Do not contact. <laughs> I think Miss, Mr. Johnson upset her. <laughs> <laughs> Just a little. <laughs> Careful now. Make sure there's no suitcases around, okay? From my perspective, she says, am I surprised my attorney is trying yet again to give up completely? No, it's a blessing. Yes, let's be honest. Frank Bankovic is a dud of an attorney. Oh, he is unprofessional hides, lies and is disrespectful. I had a feeling when other attorneys spoke about him went side or I rolled. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh gosh. I had a feeling when other attorneys spoke about him went side or rolled eyes saying they have some of his clients and after finding his Three public reprimands I announced to the court and which he said, quotation marks, pissed him off. <laughs> Close quote. Being the reason for his first attempted withdrawal. This was going to be an adventure, but nonetheless, I hope for the best. Unfortunately, I seem to have gotten the worst. Thankfully, there are many other professional and scrupulous, valiant attorneys still available. <laughs> All for hindsight's twenty twenty. <laughs> oh, uh, considering where we are today, um, and hopefully after all my previous letters. And six withdraws to date, not by my choice, Judge Wooten. You will remove the blindfold this time when throwing your quotation darts of justice. <laughs> darts of justice. Imagine. I just got her in the courtroom and Wooten's up on the bench. It's dark through dots. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> At the question, quotation, remember everyone has constitutional rights and should be treated fairly. <laughs> Close quote, dartboard. I didn't even finish the sentence properly. It made me laugh too much. <laughs> and you wear glasses. <laughs> so let's go for the bullseye. <laughs> Please, thank you in advance. She's a card. She's a card. Seriously. She tacks a judge and thanks him straight after. <laughs> it's like being slapped in the face. And then say thanks for her. And walks off. Oh my gosh. 
thank you in advance for hopefully caring this time. <laughs> you suck, you. Ooh, see that. Ooh, no. Ooh, no, no. Do, do, do. <laughs> she getting very big for her boots. Very, very big for her boots. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> also, if you are insistent on continuing to be my judge, as revolution is supposed to be every two years, brackets, I'm on going four now, <laughs> close brackets, and you've stated to me in your courtroom previously, I have not, because I have asked not, may you please observe and act independently as a judge and utilise your judicial authority to judicially maintain forward direction or proper lawful ethical treatment and respect of the client. In any case, effective communication between all parties, especially the client and the attorney, is being made productive regular process is being achieved <laughs> that was progress is being achieved and all around fairness of... <laughs> oh god chat i'm sorry but she cracks me up too much i need to breathe just breathe welsh breathe Ooh. Ooh. And come back to the table. You're back in the room. <laughs> Progress is being achieved and all around fairness of and in every aspect is constant. Aren't you tired of getting my letters? I'm pretty sure he is, Sarah, yeah. <laughs> I bet he is. <laughs> I'm not, they're amusing. But then again... <laughs> Yeah, but they are amusing to me. Oh, always asking about the same questions, concerns and drab information. <laughs> really, she's and acknowledging it. Please do not ignore and avoid what I have to say any longer, as I'm sure that the taxpayers are unapproving of their tax dollars, brackets, mine too, Close brackets. Being wasted for all my attorneys. You keep blundering. Oh my gosh, it's the judges for the attorneys are blundering. No. It took almost 14 months before my I told you so moment with bank events and all my other attorneys. 42 months total. Please also see finally, finally, the abs absolute unfairness, fabrications, impediments, illegalities and dysfunctions ongoing in my case and how truly and mistakenly ransacked by the justice system and perverted by the whole world my entire case has been and become. Add yourself also to the mayhem, hype and added difficulties. <laughs> oh, this is underlined, <laughs> chat. This is underlined and caps locked, okay? <laughs> caps, capital letters. I have unfair opportunity in everything with all predisposed, non-permissive, illegally distributed, case-altering sensitive information and details spread globally for everyone's viewing except me. <laughs> that was one long sentence I needed to go <laughs> My my hand is known before the cards are even out of the box. <laughs> There's 
not a bell anyway. That hasn't already been rung for all to hear. <laughs> I can hear the bells. <laughs> Seeds have been planted all illegally and unfairly. For the monumental amount of time allowing the world to abuse and devastate my private case information, lack of proper orders, not having appropriate attorney and non-existent security and protection, what the heck, of any kind, for all said information becoming so easily accessible, mutilate, mutilated, no, no, mutated, and shared without my permission and before my trial. It is unfair and unlawful that a heavily prejudiced, ignorant, incorrect prejudgment has been made as a result. This could have been stopped, lessened or averted if someone was doing their job correctly. I am still doing mine by telling you so. <laughs> I am not wrong. <laughs> Did you not realise this public record? <laughs> no, I am not wrong and it's my job to tell you so. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. No, still. <laughs> I believe... It all depends on how much money, notoriety and benefits anyone and everyone can get for themselves. And however, no matter the destruction caused or the ominous irreparable shadow made along the very lucrative way, a, quote, system for all the wrong reasons. As for Bankovitz and his, quote, irreconcilable differences, quote, this means because I have asked again about his, quote, phantom phone numbers and any progress occurring since not speaking to him in months. And after, oh, you we got stats, we got stats, people, people with the numbers, who like the numbers, here we go. 408 days, 58 weeks plus, 9,792 hours of his Quote, representation, brackets from the date of appointment, 7-11-22, to withdraw attempt, 8-22-23, close brackets, with only six in-person meetings, brackets totaling seven hours out of 9,792, uh, that's bad, close brackets, four to 15 minute, four, sorry, four 15 minute video visits, and two phone numbers given, zero working, zero calls answered, ten letters from me, client, trying to communicate, no response, eight letters from me, client, to judge, no response, <laughs> brackets, productively, close brackets, four letters from me, client, to my investigator, asking him to attempt communication on my behalf, to bank of it. Five known attempts by my investigator, close up <laughs> brackets, 8-2-23 letter, close brackets, by himself directly and on my behalf, no response. Nine attempts made by outside sources on my behalf, including phone calls, voicemails, emails, no response. Also, trying to use recycled components in my case. No discovery, witness list, research orders, instructions, records, depositions, downloads, etc. after 13 months. Nothing but confirmation of his lack of professionalism, principles, disrespect, lies and not caring. And please note, she starred this one, she got like a starry pen. Ooh, like one of those, like when you get those for your kids, you know. Like for the arts and crafts stalls, and you got like a moon and a star on a felt tip pen, and you just blot it. There's a star. I wonder where she got her arts. Maybe she'd been a hobby craft, 
No, she couldn't go there because she's in jail. And she's done an order online. Do they allow you to order online? Or be craft? Or maybe you've gone to li the li library. The law library? Do you think that they give the markers? i got questions now. But it's a proper star. It's, 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 a, it's like a, a dotted star. Like a stamp. That's it, a stamp. Uh, but you but but the kiddies get them over here in pens. Uh, and it can be a little of heart. You stamp a little of heart. Is it again for my daughter, my did. Anyway. And please note, star, 11 out of 13 months were, are, with no communication. None in any form. Oh, she's angry in his letter mind. This is going on. Oh my gosh, this is a long letter. The only difference is I want progress, productivity, honesty, respect and results. Whew. If he was such a professional attorney, quotes, from the beginning and not selling me as his stable of witnesses, historical stable of witnesses? Yes, yeah, that's what it says. Historical background and all his abundant resources, he wouldn't be still avoiding and cowering behind his now second attempt to withdraw. Number two, per motion to withdraw. Clearly everyone can see. Anyone. Not the love body Oh my gosh, she's talking about her slides again. Oh, the orange slides. Oh, clearly anyone who could see anyone not lobotomized in my slides would be highly unsatisfied with Bankovitz's overall performance as an attorney. See, prior data. And no dedication has been made on his part in my case or any productive progress or effort. What time has been put forth solely the seven out of nine thousand seven hundred and ninety two in thirteen months number three per motion to withdraw and as I reminded Mankovitz during one of four video visits and him repeatedly telling me how busy he is with all his other murder cases after again after all his other murder cases. <laughs> you mean like yours, Sarah? Allegedly. <sighs> I'm going to read that back. <laughs> I need to do a full sentence. She cracks me up halfway through sentence, C chat, and then I, and I did get put off and I have to go back. Ah. <sighs> Repeatedly telling me how busy he is with all his other murder cases after again no communication for months, I politely raised my hand to the camera where he could see and said, Murder case! <laughs> she held her hand up. Murder case! That's me. I am your client also and have been. When do I get to go to trial like all the other clients? He said he had to think about everything and disconnected. No word since a hundred days later, except for the withdrawal I learned about from Court TV. Not him. Number four per motion to withdraw. Judge Wooten, with everything I have stated and all my information produced to you in all my previous letters, so you are aware, clearly, Bank of it, should not continue being my attorney. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs> clearly, you should have listened and reviewed much earlier when I was trying to communicate to you ten letters ago just about him, please listen and include me going forward. It is my right. <laughs> oh, 
Hang on a second. I got an upside down page. <laughs> That's not helpful, is it? Can't read upside down, man. Oh, am I? Oh my goodness me! Hang a bang now, chat. I got to turn off the rotate because I, if I, I don't know. If it's this part. Ah, uh, hang a second. I'm turning them upside down now so I can read. And I'll see, because I got another page then. Right, okay, so. Okay, I got you, right? I got to read the upside down page. Here we go. <laughs> Rotation turned off. <laughs> With that being said, and because in the past you have stated to me you have other priorities, not allowing me rightful, appropriate time to speak in your courtroom. <laughs> oh, she, 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 she is a, I, I want to say she's a cow, because that's like a saying over here, oh, she's a cow. Oh, she's a bloody cow. But we don't mean like the moo, moo cow kind of thing. We just, you're a cow bag. Do you know what I mean? Oh, you look how bad you know exactly what you're doing. Know exactly what you're doing and you are pushing it and pushing it and pushing it, girly. And, and, yeah, yeah. Cow bag. I, say, I think I can get away with cow bag, I think. Anyway, I could have said more inappropriate things. Uh... So, you have stated to me that you have other priorities, not allowing me rightful appropriate time to speak in your courtroom when I am allowed permittance to my meetings and I am on your schedule for that day. Four times going to court with bank of it, total times with all other attorneys, three, seven times in ongoing for years oh here we go more stats one april 29 2022 first attorney withdrawal attempt judge made revise twice uh, two may 10 2022 first attorney withdrawal attempt agreed and granted trial was 5 23 3 december 27 22 sixth attorney withdrawal attempt denied I never even knew about it until stated in court during status hearing. No copies received yet. 4 February 10th, 2023 status hearing carry over. 4, 5 March 31st, 2023 status hearing carry over. 6 May 21st, 25th, 2023 status hearing carry over. Judge stated I was delayed, delaying trial. Me hence... Me, hence my letter, dated 6 29 hand delivered, second copy, 7 July 21, 2023. Status hearing, carry over. Judge stated he has other priorities for the day when I was trying to address the court. <laughs> Caps, locks and underlined. Please grant Frank Bankerfit's motion to withdraw as my attorney. I, Sarah Boone, permit Judge Wayne Wooten to please. Frank, please release. Please release me. Let me go. <laughs> please release Frank Bankerfit entirely from my case for obvious aforementioned reason stated i will allow when it should be i will allow withdrawal when it should be termination we all know it me and my hope next <laughs> the only difference is i want progress productivity honesty respect the results oh no i've gone backwards <laughs> sorry in the meantime, <laughs> I had to, I had to do the flippy round thing again. <laughs> I had to go back to the you know where is is the right side up. In the meantime, of the re selection of my next attorney, 
aim, please. <laughs> aim. Aim, please. So you say to a little tart lady who's in the like, oh. <laughs> Aim, please. <laughs> Give the little patches on the back of the toilet and you go, aim please, little boy, aim please. Yeah. Not to do any judge, man. What are you on about, Sarah? Welsh, Sarah, man. Seriously. Do, do, do. What are you going to do with him, man? Aim please. <laughs> and also... Going forward, please enable and support me in still trying to utilise my constitutional rights. And as a still a proud citizen of the United States, and stop willingly, actively allowing the violations of said rights. See previous letter, dated 5-15-23. Please include me. Please listen to what I have to say. No one else does or has. It's my case. <laughs> Hopefully, <laughs> futuristically, with a better, more appropriate professional attorney of your choosing, less letters, if any, will be generated and more time you will have to dedicate to all your, quote, priorities you have made known to me in the past. Oh, oh you look how bad you suck, yeah. Please know also, Your Honour, I know I am not priority as you condescendingly. She, <laughs> she says the word condescendingly after she's condescending. Oh... I am not a priority, as you condescendingly and incorrectly stated. Not am I making myself, no, sorry, no am I making myself out to be or ever been in anything my entire life. I am a client to my attorney, now seventh and all prior, an inmate to the county jail and, quote, Criminal, criminal case for your righteous judgment. Quote, still. <laughs> Clearly after yet another letter from me and another withdrawal, not by my choice. And yet you just... <laughs> Please release Mr. Bankowitz. Let him go. <laughs> but not very my choice, mind. <laughs> she doesn't like it that he got there first. <laughs> and to an eventful... Oh, no, no, 40... Oh, I can't even see that, man. And 42 an eventful months later, still looking for the starting line. And seven times more, nothing has been made priority. Please help Bankovitz wipe the sweat from his brow and inform him he can stop the self-sabotage. He is no longer my attorney. Amen. <laughs> my perseverance is real. So is my truth. I can't wait to meet the bullseye, court-appointed, audacious gratitude. Well, Sarah Ball. Oh, she continues. <sighs> Important. Like the rest of it was, I mean, okay, this bit is. Important. Please send me a copy of this letter, as the court used to. Consistency question mark so i have received and know it was received and hopefully read oh maybe they stopped sending them back to her then she wants them sent back to her now <laughs> i want to read my own letters that i wrote to you okay 
I do not have the resources being in jail still. Well, yeah, you are you are in there for allegedly murdering George or Jorge or who I'm sorry, any Spanish people out there or I I I, I tried to pronounce it's because I can do Portuguese to George and like Jesus and things like that. But I don't, okay, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. But I mean, no offence, okay? Please don't take any offence. So I say George, but I, I think he prefers, oh, well, he preferred to be known as Jorge. But I don't know if I'm saying it right, so that's why I say George. And 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 because I can't get the it round. I know Spanish and Portuguese are similar, but uh, still, that that's my that's my reasons. All right, I I I don't mean mean any offence by it. I can't even pronounce my own language at times. So here we go. I do not have the resources. Being in jail still to make this needed copy myself no the pen ink to rewrite she's running out of pen ink again <laughs> hopefully my next letter will be less involved from all the necessary remedies being made also my attorney is a really an attorney <laughs> thank you in advance for the copy brackets 10 pages close brackets you okay then a precious time. <laughs> Go back. <laughs> I will look for in the mail. Once the copy has been mailed again. So grateful. Well said a boon. <laughs> oh, John. I was let the number eleven. Oh, I'm going to look at number 12. I had to just, just, just to see you. How many pages is that one? Oh, it's a shorter one. Phew! But then we, but then after that, I know that we we gotta get to like that big, uh, that big huge one. Letter. Now I'm talking about mind the the thirty uh, fifty eight page one. Oh my gosh! I don't know. I'm gonna get through it. I don't know. If you want if you want me to do the fifty eight page one, let me know in the comments. Um because you know, I could make a Sarah Sarah Bones uh law dictionary because I I I know that she just, you know, likes to um bring out uh, definitions, you know, of the law. And you know, it might be an it might be a a welcomed um, law lessons from Sarah Bones. You never know. So let me know in chat if you'd like to have the 58 page one and I'll try and get my hands on that one. Um. Okay, so this is now letter number 12. We finally got the chat. This was sent August 30th, 2023 to the Clerk of Courts. And she says, Clerk of Courts, Judge Wooten. Anyone? <laughs> oh gosh! So confused, so tired of the perpetual question marks over my head. They're always perpetual. <laughs> Why just wait just no question marks or questions? I have. <laughs> Why are they always perpetual question marks over my head? <laughs> As usual. Thanks to the ongoing convolution of everything from no communication, no system, not including me, and no care. I can't ask my attorney because he's trying to withdraw again. I wouldn't get a response anyway. It's funny how the only piece of correspondence via mail I have actually received from Bankovitz in his motion to withdraw his counsel, number two, 
Judge Wooten, please clarify my requested information as follows so I, the defendant in my case, can prepare and plan accordingly. See letter dated 629-23, hand-delivered, second copy, 721-23. What is going on? This information in question is all I have from an outside source looking on the clerk's website to keep me updated since no one else will. I've tried to dilute some of the question marks, but you but need you, Judge Wooten, to help correct it and begin my preparation. Oh jeez. Please clarify and send copies for Chat There's two pages on me. I don't know whether this was sent before or with or after. I know the dates I've said, but my mind's gone a bit of a blur now. Um, but this is what she wants copies of. And it's, in, it's, it's all bolded and underlined. <laughs> and bullet pointed. I can do bullet points. Much easier. No stars this time, mind. That's not me saying goodnight, no star. No stars. Sorry. No, no. I can see sounds like no star. No stars. Me. No star is good night in Welsh. And when I say no stars, it sounds a bit like that, doesn't it? I just realised. So I have to pronounce it no stars. Right. No stars. I wonder if a magic pen got taken away. I'll be craft run out to something. This is what she wants copies of. Filed. July 21, 23. Title, Notice of Hearing, for Pre-Trial Conference, when, September 8, 2023, 9am, defendant received copy, yes, from court, <laughs> she's asking questions and answering herself, is defendant attending, unknown, <laughs> why didn't I receive a copy from attorney, filed, July 26, 2023, title, Notice of Ex Parte, question mark, for Notice of ex parte, when September 8, 2023, 9am, defendant received copy, no, from either, need copy if defendant attending, unknown, I thought the pre-trial conference was on this date, see previous filing, is this meeting for the recycled psych psychologist, recycled psychologist, why is she recycled? What does that mean? Why didn't I receive a copy? I'm interested in that bit, man. Why didn't she explain that bit to me a bit more from a recycled psychologist? I don't understand. Why didn't I receive a copy from court? Why didn't I receive a copy from attorney? Filed. August 22, 2023. Title. Notice of hearing. For status hearing. When? September 15, 2023. 9am. Defendants receive copy? Yes, from court. Is defendant attending? Unknown. Is this for motion to withdraw? It was filed on the same day. If not, what's for spe what specifically? Why didn't I receive a copy from my attorney? Filed. August 2022. 20, sorry, August 22, 2023. Title, motion to withdraw his counsel, defendant receive copy, yes, brackets, from attorney, why didn't I receive a copy from court? Filed, August 22, 2023, title, notice of hearing for motion to withdraw, Bank Bankovic signed document, when? September 8, 2023, 9am, defendant receive copy? No, from either, need copy. Is, def is defendant attending? Unknown. Two meetings are already scheduled on this day, see previous filings. What is correctly happening? This was filed the same day as attorney's motion to withdraw. Why didn't I receive a copy of this from him also? Why didn't the court send a copy with a stat status hearing notice filed the same day as the motion to withdraw? What date is correct for the actual motion to withdraw? <laughs> Again, what is going on and when? 
I am really included on or in, in the certificate to service for any document filed or anything else. It should be an automatic inclusion. Please send revised and or all correct copies of the aforementioned documents. So I have my for my records and is the only way I know unless able to find an outside source. Again, receiving copies of notifications, updates, schedules, everything to all my meetings, conferences should be automatic. So I know it is my right. Please include, finally. <laughs> Am I really the only one who is trying to figure anything out for and about my case to finally conclude? Oh, it's far from concluding, lovely. <laughs> Got a long way to go yet. <laughs> Sorry to tell you, but you know, <laughs> being a print and everything. <laughs> got a long way to go yet. We haven't even got to trial. <laughs> Shouldn't I, the defendant of all parties in my case, <laughs> of all parties? <laughs> How many parties are there? <laughs> Shouldn't I, as the defendant of all parties in my case, be included overall and receive necessary needed copies? Please clarify everything. Sarah Boone. <laughs> That's the end. That's the end, Chad. She angry on this one, mind and she? Who? Lip in air, man. I don't know. I'm going to take another sip of some water. Oh, got to rehydrate, see? Oh, I tell you what, these letters take it out to me, they do, Chad. They did take it out to me because I do think I try and, like, read it as I see it. But when she's shouting, I think, well, she's shouting. She's, you know, there's some of the things she says to the judge. It's like, oh, my God, no, you didn't just say that, did you? And then in the next breath, you've been all nice. And you think that that works. And it's probably because you've done that your whole life. You've been like that your whole life. I don't know. Well, some point in your life, I think, something happened and changed. And I'm not talking about... George's person. But anyway, Dad, I need a break. Just a whiff. And then I'm going to try and move on to one of our books. And see if I can get another video ready for you. Thanks for bearing with me, as always, Dad. You know me. Can do some days, can't do others, never know which ones I can do. That should be my motto, really. I always just say, don't know what I can do from one day to the next. But can do some days, can't do some other days. Never know which days I can do what. See, I forgot my motto, so it's not a good motto. Anyway, thank you, thank you, thank you to all the new subscribers as well because you you showed me so much love recently in RA's chat um, when he had me on for the uh, reading of the transcript of the YSL Young Thug trial um, secret ex parte meeting. I played Attorney Bumpus and I played uh, Attorney Hilton and uh, R.A. Scott, he played the judge and he played Kenneth Copeland, would he? So that was real fun and I've linked that in the community tab. So if you click on that, you can watch that 
over and and bear with it because I think I'm going, so I leave. And then afterwards, I didn't realise there was more transcripts, and then I felt bad, so I I then jumped back in. But I was stuck backstage in the green room, just just a, so I I watched the whole thing from backstage, and then eventually S- Scott sees me. Although it says the host can see you. He then sees me and he goes, Welsh lady, how long have you been there? And, and and so he brings me on then and I help him to... I help him... <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. I help him then to read the rest of the more chants. And we had fun. It was a great time. And thank you for those who in that chat paid so many compliments and just, just your funny comments. I love... Listen, I know how I sound, right? And if I use someone doing a Welsh accent, um, I find it hilarious. I can laugh at myself. You know, I know there was a comment on there about every time I do something, a pot of tea ends up on the stove. <laughs> I thought that was quite amusing. I was asked to uh, say a few things few things in Welsh and even Colin, which I was very surprised at chat, that a lot of you didn't know that Colin was an eggy and I had an eggy, Italian greyhound. Well, yeah, that's, that's who Colin is. He's on my thumbnail and Poppy, they're on my thumbnail. They've been with us all along. And there's pictures of him, I think, in the first video I ever did. Um, but he's uh, he showed himself off, he did on camera and then he got under his blanket and um which is where he is now and poppy's fast asleep and i'm gonna go and have a whiff that's what we say we're just gonna go and have a whiff have a breather and remember chat i think so much of you and i thank you thank you so much for listening i hope you've had a bit of a laugh today and brightened your day and uh, I shall see you in the next video. Ta-da! Oh, she's Welsh Lady Reads. Yes, she's Welsh Lady Reads. Oh, she's your Welsh Lady Reads.